Hello. Welcome to Chronicles of Kiona. We're back in Feed the Beast Unleashed, and Aid is running, roaming around my video. He's like a very good silent partner until he gets in the way. <laughs> I'm kidding, of course. Today, I don't know what we're doing. <laughs> but Aid's been busy. The reason why I say Aid is I don't do anything around here. That's what he's for. He, he's really good at building a base quickly. If you can count this as a base, considering we have no roof or walls. But yeah. He got us an ME network. With some 16k storages, which aren't going to last very long. At this rate, if I keep throwing in things with several different IDs, like wool. Hey, I didn't throw the color wool in. I threatened to, but I never did it. Let me see. I got a new purple tree in the middle of the base. Because we are secure in ourselves enough that we love the color purple. Yes. Well, green's my favorite color, but I, I do like purple. I'm very fond of purple. And I planted a tree. We'll ignore that. I don't know why my computer keeps wanting to do that. But, that's pretty much it. So, today, I have the stuff. I need some aqueous, 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 something like that. Accumulators. So, we're gonna make them. Uh, we. I need a bucket, a machine frame, a thingy, and some more thingies. So let's start with the machine frames, which I don't remember how to make, and I forgot the gold, which is oh god in there. Oh, we need one gold ingot, but I'll throw those into the furnace to be smelted. Oh, we need to make a few of them, so I need a few gold ingots. We'll make four. That should be more than enough. Actually, I think we only need three. pretend I know what I'm doing, but I'm actually clueless. Ask anybody who knows me. There we go. So we got some of them, we got our buckets, now we need our... to turn off magnet mode, so I stop getting eggs in my damn inventory. Doing this by memory since I have that thing in my way. Then we. Okay. There, see, I'm not that clueless. I do kind of know what I'm doing. And then we need our three buckets. One, two, three. There we go. Three aqueous, aqueous, whatever. Water makers. We'll call them water makers. I'll show you why. Once I get me some liquid ducts made. I'm just going to make 32. Why not? Oh. That's actually two stacks of liquid ducts. Uh... We'll make it one stack of liquid X. There we go. I don't have a wrench. So, let's not mess this up. Well, the core needs to be replaced down. And I kind of was playing around with design, and it turns out I actually need this water now. For what I want to do here. Well, let me move my portal. <laughs> One, two, three, four. 
I don't know why I'm using my diamond pickaxe, though. It would kick my butt. Just ignore that. That's more design purposes than anything. It'd help if I had my magnet mode back on, now that I'm away from those eggs. I think I have to use a diamond pickaxe on the in their chest. I just didn't want to mine it. Make sure I have my size right. Yep, I got my size right. Oh! Run into the portal. Need to be careful about doing that. Stuff all set up. That's all right. So we place that there. Actually, that's not where I wanted to place it. Can you pick it up with a pickaxe? Let's hope so. Yep, you can. Place that down. Instead of... So... We wanna... Oh, that redstone torch is in my way. So now they'll get water that way, and that should fill them up pretty well. And so I should need less than six force gems per one now, per quarry. But, that's all theory at this point. So... What the aqueous accumulator does is it sucks in water from its sides and pipes it out. And if you put it, you, it doesn't take the water. It's more generating water from water. We'll put it that way. See, our water is full, or almost full in both of our engines. And we'll do just fine. What was that? I'm oh, sorry. I've been cor corrected by aid that it generates water from condensation. So it generates water from water. So we got our quarry back up. So we gotta start. Kinda. Yeah. Now what I want to do is I need to clear out an area for the tree, the multi-farm. And I need to make a force engine and a couple water pools and all that. I'm thinking. I'm thinking about where to put this stuff. Because right now our rubber trees aren't really all over the place. They're just... Mm. It's not efficient at all. And I don't know why Aid has these fence posts up, but they're being moved. I think this is where I'm going to put it. Oh my god, everything is popping up on my computer right now. I don't know why. Apparently, Norton wants to tell me that Minecraft's taking up a lot of space, or a lot of CPU, and my webcam decides that it wants to say, Oh, yeah, I'm still here. Don't forget about me. Next thing I know, I'm going to probably get a Windows update pop up. Everything wants to know that, or wants to interrupt. We'll just put it that way. 
you know, now that we have fly, do I really need this here? So, I can t do like a walkway over. <laughs> Pick that up. Oh, we never really needed it three wide anyway. Now we have a one wide walkway over to the other side. Clear off these stumps real quick. Okay. Now I need a place to put the water. So I need two three by one. Oh my goodness. Hold on one moment. I'll be right back. And we're back a little more prepared than we were in the beginning of the episode but we have our farm area cleared out with an area to put the multi farm and we have our aqueous accumulator set up for all that and now we're still in the process of making our components because we have our farm blocks so we need to make our components now which I have the wood so I just need cobblestone. So stop doing that. There we go. Punch the cobblestone barrel. And eat some. <laughs> some berry medleys. I need to make more. I have plenty of barrel of berries here, so you'd think it would be easy for me to make more. I just need a stack. Making way more than what I need here. Oh well. I think I only need eight stone gears, and I'm making 16. Oh, well, uh, we're prepared for next time, right? Why did I just do that? I just split the gears. I apologize for the kids in the background. I have tried to keep them quiet. I have. It is just nearly, if not impossible. Okay, stone gears, move the tin, put the tin in, that is not enough, hold on, one moment, wow, that was bad timing, the kids went crazy, and I don't know what's wrong with them, <laughs> it's two three-year-olds and my five-year-old daughter, so, they don't understand, and as much as I would love them to understand, it's not as easy as it looks. It's not easy at all. Okay, there we go. We got our ten gears. I only needed six ten gears. Son of a biscuit eater. Two of those needed to be force gears. Oh, yeah. Well, I have extras now. I know what I'm doing, I swear. It may not look like it, but I kind of know what I'm doing. Redstone. I need more glass, too. Before. Why did my mouse just do that? It just jumped across the screen. Piston. Four gears. And yes, I know that piston's in the wrong spot. Darn it. Darn it, 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 darn it. Let's 
try this again. This is the glass. That's how you make an engine. Oh, that makes sense. So we got our fourth engine. Which if I had a redstone torch, which I don't. I wonder if we have any sticks in here so I don't have to make sticks. There we go. What's the point in making a bunch of sticks when you only need one? There we go. Alright. I'm going to set that up so I can clear some room in my bags real quick. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, I'm too far down. I just realized that. There we go. Why did I just type that wrong? Farm. I'm sorry, guys. I'm really, really sorry. I have asked everyone. But when you live with a lot of people in one small little house, I don't care what the size of my house is, it's turned into a small little house now. Yeah. And I don't have enough room for this because I keep getting the damn eggs thrown in my bags. Magnet mode off. There we go. One moment, somebody is at my door. I think it's quiet enough now. I I'm trying my best. I'm sorry so for so many cuts here. But now we need to make the valve and the control, and then we'll be done making the components. Yay! We gotta start. So let's go over here. And we'll put the multi-farm together, and then next episode we will probably do the setup. So, I am going to need a valve. Does the power go into the gearbox or the control? I don't remember. Okay. So, we'll put the gearbox on bottom where the engine's going to be. The valve on top of that. And then we'll place the control and the hatch through. What do you mean, no free spot ahead of you? And I think it's solid. I'm pretty sure it's solid. A solid 3x3x3x4. Three by three by three by if not, I have extra pieces. And I lagged out there, so that's fine. There we go. So we got it built. Now where's my engine? Oh, I'm gonna need some force gems. We'll do 32 for now. I'll just sit in there. And 
was it? There we go. And we'll simply do it this way. Connect them all. Reminds me of Pokemon. And I don't have a wrench! I need a wrench! I need a wrench, I need a wrench, I need a wrench. How do you make a wrench? How do you make a wrench? Wrench. I need a force wrench. That's what I need. I'll be fine with a standard wrench. Thank you, Aid. He knows when to throw things at me. There we go. So we got... Now we have the water and all that going in. But I'm not going to put the force in right now. Because there's no point. Because I need to get the circuit made. The intricate circuit and everything else. So. Let's see. I need to make a circuit. Intricate. There we go. Three gold. Three. One, two, three. And I'll just grab that. I've been using redstone like crazy. A got me all set up with a carpenter and everything. He takes care of me. He even threw red or he threw a soldering iron at me too, so I don't have to make nothing. Oh, stretch. Sorry. As we wait and wait and wait, thank you. I'm impatient. All right, now I need the soldering iron. Right click in the air, put the circuit in, switch it to manual farms. So now we have the circuit that goes in. And my son is in my office. <laughs> that goes there. I'm just going to slash through again. <laughs> you know what? My son's having a good time. I don't think I'm gonna even interrupt him. He is three and thinks he is the most entertaining child in the world and he's not. But I guess as long as he's happy. I just wish he wasn't so loud. As I place down my stone bricks. Then I gotta fill this up with dirt. Did I throw all my... Ah, I threw all my dirt back in the ME. I will collect it. To the dirt! Wait, I have a wireless access terminal. Why do I keep running back? I'm going to put a marker on where these corners are, or these edges are, so I know where I can and where I can't build. Alright. I, I don't think I have to manually plant a rubber tree farm. It's not like a chestnut farm or anything like that. I don't think. I don't know. I still got my edges marked. Or my center points marked, I should say. Not my edges, because they're... I got my points marked. There we go. My points. So we just fill this up with dirt. As the sun sets on the little server we call home. Oh, darn it. That's not good. 
That's really not good. That's gonna be bad. That could be bad. Where? T claim. There we go. Gotta make sure my town's clean so nobody takes anything. Fertilizer, please. Would help if I could spell fertilizer. I did not right click, you stupid mouse. I need a new mouse. So give me a stack of appetite and two stacks of sand. I've been informed that it's better I don't do a full stack of appetite. So, there we go. Now we got two stacks of fertilizer. So now we put the fertilizer in. Come on. There we go. That's right. That's right. Then we put the saplings in too, right? Yeah. And we give it a little bit of power. And shouldn't it plant them automatically or do I have to do that? I'm confused. Or was I supposed to give it dirt? I mean, it, it's different. It's different than when you set up a... The only ones I've ever done are the... What's in my column? For orchards. You don't, it, you need to set the saplings first, and then supply it with saplings. It'll replant. Okay. See, it's a good thing I'm worthless. Oh my goodness. They're getting loud again. I never get a break. I want a break. I want a vacation. The sad thing is it's the adults being loud now. There we go. I planted my saplings. Now I need some... <laughs> so I can at least start this. There we go. Our tree is up. Our rubber tree farm is up, I should say. Yep, there we go. It's getting resin, so it works. It works. It works. It works. It makes me happy. Now, I would say that even with all the noise, which is worse than construction noise, and my phone ringing... It's been an okay episode. So, yeah. I'm not answering that.
only you could turn the ringer off the fax machine. Okay. <laughs> I'm just gonna trim all these leaves off the river trees for now. And put on my magnet mode so I can get my rubber saplings back from this. Of course. I think I'm gonna break my... Oh, I broke my thingy. But yeah. Okay, guys. I will catch y'all next time. Remember to like, favorite, subscribe. Follow me on Twitter and Twitch. And hopefully I'll be able to do a decent episode without a circus going on in the background. Catch y'all later. Bye-bye.